Cheese and welcome back to another video. It's your girl Pamela and guess what y'all? Today is Vlogmas Day 19 and 20 <laughs> because I'm going to need to um, combine two videos because I already know I'm not uploading that the video on the 19th because I've been doing so much trying to catch up for Christmas that I have not had time to sit down and edit a video. So I'm going to combine, you know, two videos to catch myself up. Anywho, what I'm thinking about doing is I have the ingredients to make a lemon box pie or, or a lemon fridge pie. It's called something like that. It's a lemon pie. And so I have most of the ingredients. I don't have everything I need. So I'm going to go out to Walmart and get the ingredients for the, for, to make this pie. Um, I'm practicing on making this pie because I plan on making a lemon pie for Christmas and I've never made one before. So I got to kind of test it out, test it on my family. Um, and so that's what I'm going to do. So I'm on my way to the store, um, to get the ingredients and just stay tuned. Cause I'm going to show you myself making this pie for the very first time. Okay, y'all, I'm about to make my lemon box cake, and um, what it calls for is you got to have a, either use real lemons or the, I use 100% lemon juice, the real lemon, 100% juice. I have a graham cracker crust. Um, I have some cream cheese, so it's just some Philly cream cheese, and you need three egg yolks. Not the white, you need the egg yolks. And so, what I'm gonna do first is, oh, I got rid of my scissors. So what I'm gonna do first is, I'm gonna use, oh, oh, it also calls for a can of sweet and condensed milk. So get, can you get that out for me, please? So you also need a can of sweet and condensed milk. I let my um, cream cheese stay out so that it can get soft. And so I have some Eagle Brand sweet and condensed milk. So what I'm going to do is just pour, pour this whole can in there so it's a real simple it's a real real simple recipe easy to make and it's this is my first time making it so i'm talking like i'm an expert and i'm really not but i eat them all the time so i've already cracked my egg I'm just gonna, uh oh, sorry y'all, y'all see I just made that mess, I just made a big mess, so I'm just gonna so I'm not wasting any egg because we cook eggs all the time, so I'll, I'll, I'll just put the white away and we'll use the egg whites for breakfast or something. So then I need two thirds cup of, uh oh. <laughs> I need two cup, two thirds cup of lemon juice. I might do a little bit more cause I like my, my lemon pie a little tardy. So I'm just gonna pour all this together and just give it a good stir. My blender is out of whack, so I'm gonna have to stir this up and get back to you in just a moment. So I think I have it the consistency I want. My um my blender is broke, so I had to like hand stir it, and it took me, I want to say about eight minutes to get it all stirred into the consistency that I saw. So I don't know if you guys can see it, but you want to get all the chunks of that cream cheese out as much as you can. So 
So that's what I've done. So I'm going to pour this into my graham cracker crust. And I think what, what this is you're supposed to do is set, put this in the refrigerator and let it sit. But on one of the channels I saw, she gave like a quick tip. She said if you want, if you want to taste it sooner or you want it to set quicker, you can put it in the oven on 350 50 degrees for about, I believe she said about 10, 15 minutes. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm not sure if this is too much for one pie crust, so I'm just going to pour in here, guys, to just see. I might have to use two. I don't know. I might be. Yay! It took one crust, guys. So I guess they had it all measured out correctly. So... That's what it looks like. So it looks good. I'm going to sit it in the oven and I'm for about, I think about 10 minutes or so and let it kind of set. And then from there, it'll go in the refrigerator. Okay guys, so here's what my lemon ice box pie i believe i said cake earlier but it's actually a pie so here's what it's looking like it actually had to stay in the oven for about 20 i think about 20 minutes um because i wanted the jiggliness out of it it still has just a little i don't know if you can tell that it's jiggly just a little bit but it's it's pretty set and so now it just needs to, I'm going to sit it out for a little bit, let it cool down, and then I'm going to put it in the refrigerator. And it should be ready for us to taste test tomorrow. Um, it's my first time. Looks like it turned out pretty good to me. Okay. Lemon ice box pie. Okay, guys. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also give us a thumbs up as well as hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever we put out a video. As always guys, for panties, make every day a great day. Peace!